The final race of the day here from Taunton then is the Fred Winter Maiden. It's a, another Maiden chase. It's over three miles this time though. Uh, the top one is alive and kicking for Martin Leader. Bonjour for Paul Rhodes, Chernick, Oli McCormack, Christopher's Burner, Ryan Costello, Gypsy King, Alex Cherry, Lord's Kingdom, Jim Murray, Pyra Hanfer for Graham Clutterbuck, Sizing Blues for James Shea, Sunbeam Talbot, John Morgan, Yorkshire Scent for Craig Allen, Big Fat Truth for Greg Beckwith, Lily Branches, David Hooley, Little Green Bag, Ryan Tamasebi, Rag Top Skoda Car Chase for Leon Van Rensburg, Special Cargo, David Robertson, and Wadia Smiles for Darren Thompson. So 16 of them then. Good big field in this one, calling and away they go then. Very short run to the first, which is a big ditch. Uh, they've all got over it okay, and they sort themselves out and see who wants to go on. Gypsy King is prominent at this early stage on the near side, but nothing seems all that keen to lead at the moment as they make their way towards the second of the 18 fences, and the grey alignment kicking is coming through to take it up. And it's alignment kicking, looks like it's going to be the leader from Gypsy King and Big Fat Truth, then Sunbeam Talbot on the near side, and towards the back, Christopher's Burn as the back marker. So once again, we've got Grey's top and tail in the race as Alive and Kicking gets over towards the fence and leads by about a length coming into this plain fence, which is fence number two. And there's a crashing fall there for something. Gypsy King it was that's gone. So Gypsy King is a faller up in the second as they take the third. And a bit of a slow jump there by Yorkshire Scent as well. But it's Alive and Kicking who suddenly found himself three or four lengths clear. Well, it could have been on sufferance to start with, but they've got to make the best of it. It will see when they skip over from number four and jumped it quickly and nicely and got away from it well. So it's alive and kicking in the lead then by about four lengths as they come up past the stand. They've got another couple of circuits to go. Yorkshire has since recovered from that mistake and has moved into second place. As they pass the winning post, then two more circuits to go. Alive and kicking in the lead by about four or five. To Yorkshire sent in second. Lord's Kingdom is third and Sizing Blues is four. Bonjour is five and Pyrocanther is fifth. And then comes Little Green Bag and Sunbeam Talbot. And then Big Fat Truth and Lily Branches with Wadia Smiles and other grey after that one. And then Chernick on the inside. It's a new trainer, that one, Ollie McCormack. So welcome to you. And then comes Rat Top Skoda Car Chase. Another great mouthful of a name there for Leon Van Rens. Uh, special car goes after that one and Christopher Burner is the back marker as they take number five. Another mistake by Yorkshire Scent, which is a bit of a surprise considering the stable it's come from. But it's alive and kicking who's suddenly six or seven lengths clear and seems to be going well within himself in the lead. Right in second place, Lord's Kingdom. Then Pyra Canther who's gone into third as they take this ditch, which they all successfully negotiate. Christopher's Burner is pretty much detached out of the back of the field as they take fence number seven. Ah, there's a faller there, there's another one gone. Big Fat Truth is gone. So that's their second faller in the race then. Big Fat Truth out of it for Craig Beckwith. So bad luck there. And it's a live and kicking coming out of this next ditch. Gets over it okay. Yorkshire Scent went through it again. Not jumping particularly brilliantly that one at the moment, but he's alive and kicking in the lead. Pyra Canthus just about poked his head in the second. Lord's Kingdom for Jim Murray in the black and red. Then Yorkshire Scent, who's going better on the flat than he is over the fences. Rap Tops go to car chase. He's trying to get it. Bonjour is after that one. Sunbeam Talbot is tucked in mid division. Then comes Lily Branches and Wider Smiles after that one. Special Cargo is next. And then Little Green Bag and Chernick. And that's all we've got left because Christopher's burner has departed the race while out of shot. The leader made a mistake at that one, giving a bit of a wallop. And he now, his lead is now down to a length as they come into number 10, but he jumped that one much better. So alive and kicking, he's in the lead still then, but only by a length. To Lord's Kingdom in second, Yorkshire sent his third. Gap of a couple then, back to Sizing Blues and Rap Tops go to car chase as they take that one. Slow jump there by Lord's Kingdom, but they're all over it safely. That'll be the last next time round. They've got one more circuit to go. And it's alive and kicking still in the lead from Lord's Kingdom in second. Sunbeam Talbot is third and Sizing Blues is four. Ragtop Scar chases after that one. Then comes Sizing Blues and Wadia Smart Special Cargo is getting much closer. So too Bonjour and Lily Branches. The race is on in earnest now for this final circuit. The one that looks out of it is Chernick. Little Green Bag's also got a bit of ground to make up. But it's alive and kicking by two. To Sunbeam Talbot who now moves into second. Then comes Special 
Angel Cargo's in third, Lord's Kingdom is fourth. Then Wadia Smile Sizing Blues is up for that one. Yorkshire Sense losing its place. We're on towards the back of the leading group there. Little Green Bag is now getting a little bit closer as Chernick drops right away. They take the 12th and the leader. Got it. Oh, there's a jockey on the floor there from the last time round. So we've just trampled over a half dead jockey. I've not seen that before. And <laughs> Special Cargo has come through to take it up. So Special Cargo's in the lead from Alive and Kicking in second. Bonjour is wide on the track in third as they come to this ditch. And over that one they go. And there's another fall of there at the back. Big Fat Truth had already gone. Lily Branches was the fall of this time. And the jockey was prostrate on the ground. Was off Ryan Costello's horse on the circuit before. But it's Special Cargo who's now gone three or four clear. Two sizing blues in second. Then comes Alive and Kicking the long time leader. Now beginning to beat a retreat. Bonjour's after that one. Then Rag Tops go to car chase as they take that ditch. And they're all over that one. The field's a little bit decimated, but it's Special Cargo. Now being pressed by Lord Kingdom. Then comes Bonjour. Rag Tops go to car chase. He's going to come round the outside. The Sunbeam Talbot's dropped out of it as well. Little Green Bag is running on from the back. But it's Lord's Kingdom who's taken it up from Special Cargo. Bonjour is third, then Little Green Bag, Rack Tops go to Car Chase, Yorkshire Sense trying to get into his way, surely between these as they race down towards the third last, and over that one they go, and on the inside, Special Cargo's regain the lead, Special Cargo from Lord's Kingdom, Little Green Bag, this is the second last, over it they go, and Lord Kingdom lands in front, Lord Kingdom by half a length, to on the outside, Little Green Bag on the near side, Special Cargo running on from the back, Rack Tops go to Car Chase, this is the final fence, over it they go, and it's Lord Kingdom who gets over it best, and he's pulling away again, he's being chased by a little green bag, but it's Lord Kingdom for Jim Morris and race inside the final half furlong, it's Lord Kingdom, who's got a hold on and take it, racing towards the line Lord Kingdom, so when a little green bag is second, Rack Tops going to car, chasing the special cargo then Bonjour and Yorkshire sent right here smiles after that one, field trails back to Chernick, send an ambulance out for Ryan Costello's jockey who's implanted in the ground, but Jim Murray won't be worried about that because that's his first winner of the season with Lord's Kingdom. So Lord's Kingdom, the winner for Jim Murray, Little Green Bag for Ryan Tamasebi is in second. Rag Top Skoda Car Chase for the Oliver Rensburg third. Special Cargo for David Robertson fourth. And Yorkshire Scent for Craig Allen was fifth. That's your six races from Taunton. And I'll hand you over now to Ryan Tamasebi at Hereford.